Greetings lords and ladies, Kaiser here and welcome to another episode of our Mountain Blade Gekko Kujo Damio Edition Let's Play. Now then, when last we left off, we had just destroyed the Urakami clan and, well, it's been a little bit since the last episode, or rather, what I mean to say is, I played a little bit in between episodes. What I did... Uh, was that I made use of the peace we had and went for the rest of the Hatamoto guards that we left in Kakegawa. On my way there, I also defeated a bunch of uh, rebels, Kinai rebels, etc., etc. Got a few more elite Onabushi for us. Also, this happened. We finally, I believe for the first time ever, managed to get the Mori clan to agree to a trade agreement with us. I also started a feast. Now, you know that question I had about the spice in the last episode? Uh, for whatever reason, when I talked with my wife again, the spice amount was suddenly magnificent. It was no longer scant. Uh, but yeah, I did start another feast. I was kind of hoping that maybe something happens, maybe something somebody's foolish enough to declare war on us, nobody was. So I just went ahead and declared war on the Miyoshi. Um, I was kind of hoping that more lords would be arriving at the feast and possibly not leave immediately, but when I noticed that a lot of the lords simply left Okayama and started traveling back to their own castles, I decided, alright, it's time to end the feast. The reason I wanted to, the feast to last a bit longer was because if you declare a war against a clan that has not provoked you, um... You do get a relation sh a penalty, and I was kind of hoping that the bonus that I, we would have gotten from the feast would have negated that. It did with some, not with all. Nakahara, for instance, right now is uh, on zero relation points with us. But I already contacted all of our lords, already told them that we are doing this. Um, One thing that I have not done yet, wait, let me just pop like that. Uh, I don't know, we'll do one, no, two, one, like that. Master Gunner, heck yeah, Mounted Auto Officer. We'll put back the Spearman, we'll keep everything else, Sight Officer. Alright, so, what kind of an army do we want? The usual? Uh, let's see, so that is how many Hatamoto Guards? Potentially four. So let's just say that we want... I don't know, 50 Saito Hatamoto guards, like that. Um, perhaps like 30 of... No, 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 not take, give. Like that. Um, we'll be taking... I don't know, I'm just gonna be taking all of the gunners. All of these, all of the elite Onabushi. And let's say we're gonna take 50, just for good measure. How does that look? 50, 50, that's 100, yeah, 232, that seems like a good enough army, an army that we can maintain, okay, maybe we cannot maintain them just yet, let's buy a bunch of food for the road, well, even take a daikon, sure, why not, misoshiru, um, just a bunch of fish, like that, should last us long enough. I'm just thinking, do we leave our prisoners in Okayama, or do we keep dragging them with us? Because Okayama does not yet have a prisoner tower. Oh well. At any rate, as you can see, the Miyoshi have been busy. They've been, uh, they're at war with the Mori, as you know, and apparently they've been having the upper hand. Now, I did check what the heck is going on, and the Mori, I haven't really counted how many uh, lords the Mori have, but they definitely have less than the Miyoshi. Look at this. They have 29 lords, so this war may last a bit longer than expected. Um, I was thinking that we first go for Sumoto Castle, then Tanabe Castle, and then Iwakura Castle to clean them up. Maybe they'll be fighting with the Mori as they go on. Not maybe, but definitely. Uh, I'm just thinking which path would be the fastest, because if I'm not mistaken, that is not passable over there, so we're gonna have to go around this way. Alrighty then, let us begin. 
All the lords that have been around here are following us, following village farmers, Lord Sasa. Hey now. Oh, hey. Did not expect to bump into enemies so close by. When last we met, you had me at your mercy and allowed me to go free. That was kind of you, but we are still at war. Yes, we are. Um, I say this only once. Sorry. Just attack without me. Order the attack to begin. Not sure if we lost any, but Lord Akana, I give up. I give up. Call back your dogs. You are my prisoner now. While Lord Murakami managed to escape. All right. Now, yes, I am going to auto resolve some of these battles simply because, as you saw, it was just a complete ma a complete massacre. We had way too many lords on our side. All right, so that's already two lords less, two armies less to worry about. I say we continue following Lord Sasa. Everybody's following us, but I believe that we are going to catch them. Yep, it's just one-on-one. -on -one. Lord Tokuda, I'll have to check wh uh, what he's like before. Uh, not before, but after this battle. We'll be taking the field this time. Let's see how our... Oh. Interesting positioning. Are they... Okay. For a moment there, I thought they were gonna immediately charge at us. But if they're not gonna, then we're just gonna prepare a little bit. Alrighty! This is a weird position to be in. I'm not... I'm not used to being... on bottom. And please do not take that out of context. Get this guy. Like that. Cavalry to the side, let's go. Alright, that's not exactly to the side, but good enough. I thought it was... Whew, for a moment there, I thought we were gonna slam into that spearman. Massacre! Right, so in the last episode I didn't really get to talk about history much. Um, but I do believe that we talked about um, how the Mori basically took over the entirety of the Tosa province. As well as started looking towards Eo province in the north. So, when Motochika attacked Eo province, like I said, Kono Michinao, the lord of Eo pro uh, province, was put there through the help of the Mori clan. So, the Mori clan, they were essentially vassals of the Mori, uh, Mori clan. Let's just be frank here. Um, but the Mori clan were busy fighting with the Oda. So, oh, I actually lost a unit. Damn. Alright. Uh, they were busy fighting with the Oda clan, so they wouldn't really be able to help Michinao in any sort of way. And Montochika took perfect advantage of this. Mm, let's just. We're gonna have to teeter, teeter taller all the way to Somoto. Because we know the pains of having this many lords follow you. In fact, you know what? I'm just going to make a cut right here until we get to Sumoto Castle. So, see you in a little bit. Alrighty, here we are at Sumoto Castle. And, yeah. The fact that they have 29 lords and only 6 uh, holdings. Don't, don't ask me how that's even possible. You would think that all of the lords would be very, very unhappy with Great Lord Miyoshi and would want to be leaving him in droves. Well, Sumoto has Lord Kakizaki inside as well as Lord Okamoto, who he, by the way, denied. He came to us, but he is, I believe, a calculating man, and apparently he just decided to go to our enemy, the Oka, uh, the Miyoshi. I'm try, just trying to check. Oh, Lord Akechi, it was the exact same situation. He wanted us to re-employ him yet again, and we told him no. 
The Ueda, Noriyuki, Sogo. Alright, well, they are, they have raided Misaki and they are raiding Kishiwada and I believe something else as well. Or rather, it said that medi a medium-sized group of enemies is near Sakai. We're just gonna go straight for their holdings, though. Straight into Sumoto, besiege the castle, batter down the gates, six hours, sh certainly. Let's wait for all of the lords to gather. Please do not go away, do not go on your own. Okay, here we go. Here we go. See? Not that hard. On your side, your side, your side, your side, your side, your side, your side. Everybody's on our side. Okay. And as we saw, there are about 500 to 600 defenders in there. So, not gonna be the easiest one. Considering Sumo they took Sumoto Castle not that long ago, the fact that they have 300 units uh, protecting it is pretty impressive. Alright, so, lead our soldiers in an assault. Positioning guys, positioning. Begin firing. I'm kind of afraid to shoot in such a large group of our own men. Now, it's gonna be a little bit troublesome because of course many of these men are not our Hatamoto gunners, but are simply Skirmishes of all sorts. Alright, is there any way for us to shoot those guys? Maybe not. Alright. Stand closer. Move forward. You guys follow me, let's go. Alright guys, start firing. Start firing, let's go. We're gonna go line by line over here. Never thought the Miyoshi would be this much trouble, honestly. But considering how many units, I mean, how many lords they have around this place, I'm a less, maybe, perhaps, getting just a little bit worried. Alright, go in. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, 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 Come on in, begin firing. I shall help. How that guy is not dead from an arrow to the face, I am not sure, but oh well. Hey, 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 no shooting at us. Actually moving away. Please don't stand in front of me like that. Shoot as many as possible. Why are our archers not firing? Slightly annoyed. They're coming. They're coming. Let's go. Go, 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 guys. Fire at them. Archers, meanwhile, stay here. You have a clear shot of them, so please begin firing. Yes, like that. I'm already out of arrows? Really? Damn. Oh, but it's going well. It's going well. Alright, so... Uh, Motochika, <laughs> when he went into Iyo, he first sent an army of 7,000 in 1579 to Okayama Castle, would you look at that, Okayama, but the army was defeated after its general Hisatake Chikanobu was shot and killed by an arquebus. Uh, just everybody charge, except archers, follow me, let's go. Let's go. Break the gates. There are enemies on the other side. Alright. Now, the next year, so in 1580, uh, a much more decisive Motochika entered the province with not only 7,000, but 30,000 men and forced Kono to flee to Bunga. Since neither the Mori nor the Otomo showed any interest in stepping in, Motochika boldly stepped up his raids and uh, defeated the Sogo clan in 1582 and by 1583 took control of both Awa and Sanuki provinces. Now, in 1579, Motochika actually started talks with Nobunaga with the interest of being allies, believe it or not. 
Uh, however, Nobunaga humored him, but not in true, uh, but in true Nobunaga fashion, planned on betraying him, intending on conquering Shikoku eventually, even naming his son Nobutada as the commander of that future would-be invasion. This is strangely easy, or rather has been strangely easy so far. Did not expect us to be able to make this much headway so quickly. Still don't have any arrows though, so... Korose! He says... I can't... Alright, fine. Sword out. Katana out, let's go. I can't get close enough to actually hit him. I just wanted to be a part of it. <laughs> there we go, yes, like that. Are there enemies in there? Only a couple of them. Don't worry about these guys, I got them. Archers, over here, start shooting at those guys. Don't worry about the guys in here, I'll take care of them. There are like two or three of them. If I can't take two or three down, then I don't know what. Iko Naginata Monk. Wait. Oh, okay, so new enemies have already arrived. Fine, fine. Where are these stairs? There we go. Sataka Samurai Gunner. Samurai. Yeah. Did not mean to get myself in a corner, but this'll do. Yeah. There we go. Uh, okay, so our guys are in. Wow, Lord Nakahara took down like th three? So quickly? Damn. The man's a beast! Uh, no, 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 no. Follow me, follow me. Come back, come back, come back, come back. You guys are way too deep, I think. Then again... Keep going. I'm guessing you guys can handle it. <laughs> I'm hoping you guys can handle it. Or do I just command these guys to go in as well? I'm just thinking, do I keep them here so they can possibly shoot at incoming, I mean, enemies that keep spawning over there, or do I send them in? I guess I send them in. By the way, what are those two over there? And why are they there? <laughs> oh well. See, I... <sighs> yes, just stay here and continue shooting at these guys. They're being very kind and giving me arrows and ammunition to actually help you with taking them down. Ow. They're also shooting at me, of course. Oh, more enemies have spawned. There we go. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. aiming for me, are you? Cheeky, cheeky boy. There we go. Wait, what? No, that was my scream? No, <laughs> I was like, wait, he's aiming at those guys. There's no way he's going to get me. Okay, so that was a foolish mistake on my side. Uh, meanwhile, our guys are not doing so bad. Reinforcements are coming in, and 200 units are already down on the enemy side. So that's good, that's good. Alrighty then. Uh. Now, like I said, Nobunaga intended on betraying Motochika eventually. That's not what I wanted to click. My bad, my bad. Wait, are these the last enemies? I can't press... I... no... Why? Game, why? I can't press backspace anymore to check on the... on the enemy units. 
But yeah, I think these are the last ones. Yeah! That's already the victory you're yelling. Did we... Did we really just take the entire castle with a single wave of our units? Did that actually just happen? How many units that are... Oh, only 17. Alright, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. The remaining defenders have retreated to the castle as a last defense. You must go in and crush any remaining resistance. But why, though? <laughs> it's a castle. It's not a town. I'm sad now because I have one guy versus all of this and I have... Oh no, I have half my health left. Oh no, I have two guys. Okay, I miscounted. There we go, okay. And I thought I was gonna have like 10% health or something, but I almost had half, so... Yay! Lord Okamoto, stop! I yield to you! Uh, wait, we said that you're a calculating man, so we're gonna take you prisoner. And honestly, the less units, I mean, the less lords the Miyoshi have, the better for us. So we're all, we already have two of them in our prisoner hold. So that's very, very, very nice. Plenty of rescued prisoners, most of which are Mori, apparently. Also Imagawa, aha. Uh -huh. Okay, so this castle is going to be defended. Not that well defended, but it's going to be defended. Uh, but yeah, I will see you guys in just a moment. Alrighty, welcome back. There we go. So, Sumo Sumoto Castle is ours. Now... One thing I am thinking about is, do we go after these lords first? We can probably just uh, auto-resolve all of those uh, battles. One thing that is getting me worried is that small army-ish thing over there. Wait, that's 100... I mean, that's, that's a solid amount of units, actually. And they seem to be heading towards Kishiwada, which is already being raided, so there are more lords over there. Though they might be going for Sakai, not too sure. If they're going for Sakai, we will of course beat them up over there, but Tanabe, Ca Tanabe Castle is definitely a target for us. We gotta clean this whole area up and then move into their last holding. But we have to defeat all of these guys, otherwise they're just gonna run rampant in our land. So, we've taken Sumoto Castle, hopefully nobody leaves us right now. They're not leaving us. Good, 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 good. Alright, so... Uh, people are heading in that direction. What is this? Miyoshi clan offers you a sum. Lord Akana. No, reject. He was the guy that, um, Lady No, Lord Akai, Shikisase, Murakami. I mean, he's the guy. You, I lose honor, really? <laughs> he was the guy that was, uh, burning down our villages while we were trying to fight the Murakami, so. No. God, these guys are annoying me, just running everywhere, in every direction, I mean. Okay. Uh... I have a friend here, an old warrior who is very sick. Pestilens has infected an old uh, surgeon soon, he will surely die. This man is there to me, great loyal to Gao, but he's also stubborn as a hog and refuses to have anyone look at his injury. Uh, because he doesn't trust the physicians here. I have heard that you have a capable surgeon. If you would let your surgeon... No. <laughs> I'm not about to give you one of my lords. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I'm, uh, sorry, not lords, but one of my guys. Join the battle on your side. Still not enough. I want more of you to join the battle on my side. Where are you guys going? Alright, plenty of guys on our side now. Surrender or die. Um... Troops to attack without us. Clean that up. Stop, I yield to you. You are my prisoner now. There we go. Another lord in our hold. Again, all the clicking. Anything good? Nothing, of course. Uh, I mean, they're gonna be annoying over here, but what are you... Traveling to Tamada, traveling to Ichijodani... Good God, a moment, everyone. There we go, Sakai has been besieged by Lord Hatakayama of Miyoshi Clan. Now, what do we do? Do we go and fight them at Sakai, hopefully defeat their entire army, or do we go for Tanabe Castle and then take Sakai? Something tells me we should go and defend first and then move. Oh, hey, Lord Kita's coming as well. Nice. 
Uh, so we head for Sakai first. Okay, so this war will be slightly more interesting apparently. Uh, even the notes, look at that, this is the first time I actually see this. Great host of enemies spotted near Sakai. And that is that great host. That's... I mean, a lot of those guys only have like a hundred or even sub, or, or rather under 100 units. I'm kind of hoping that this just ends up in one colossal confrontation, to be completely honest. Also, it did say, if I'm not mistaken, that there's also a large army of enemies spotted near Kawachi Castle. So, I don't know if they're gonna try and take both of them, or if they're just gonna uh, go it like if it's just two or three guys that want to go and uh, loot Kawachi for a little bit. Now then, Kita. Following Lord Hattori's party. Where is Lord... I could use your help, Kita. I really could. Wait, where are they going? Following Lord Akahoshi. Lord Akahoshi apparently has appeared. Oh, they're all piling on on him. Following farmers. Um... Hey. Hi. Do, do you not see us over here? <laughs> this is interesting. Um, surrender or die. This should be a very easy battle. And that's an additional two lords. I'm just gonna command everybody to attack without me. Uh, yeah. Do we capture? No, we didn't catch either of them. Oh, well. And we do get additional units, which is very nice. Uh, we have got to go and help out Akahoshi, though. I did call him specifically. Like, I contacted all of the lords, not just the lords within the... Um, at the feast. So, he is actually answering my becking. And it would be unseemly for us to just let him be defeated like that. Um... Everybody just piling on on him. I do not know what to do here, because everybody... Lord Hattori of Miyoshi Clan is laying waste to Sumota. I thought Kita went to go and take care of him. What the... How many units is that? 2,376, it says. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna wait for everybody else to arrive here. We can go and fight these guys before that. Sorry, Akahoshi. Really sorry. Sakai! Okay, there we go. Some soldiers are ready to... Large enemy near Sakai, Ishiyama Fortress, Kawachi Castle, Osaka. Okay, uh... Surrender or die. Hmm. I am gonna take the field this time. We are alone versus them. Oh god, what is this? What is this map? No. Okay, slightly better. I will, of course, have to remember to... Increase the lighting. Where are they? Aha! There they are. Okay, but I do believe that once we destroy the army that's trying to take Sakai, that'll be it as far as the enemy's, like, actual capabilities go. Short-term capabilities. They will, of course, be coming back, but they'll be coming back with armies like this guy. Essentially, just villagers and whatnot. Um, you know what, considering the... <laughs> how their army's built, aka villagers, let's just straight up charge at them. We won't even bother taking any prisoners, just kill them all. It's <laughs> very barbaric, but hey. No mercy. But uh, yeah, this war is turning out to be very interesting. Did not expect the Miyoshi, like, that was, I suppose, my fault as well, of course it was. Uh, not checking the uh, diplomacy screen to check just how many lords uh, just how many lords the Miyoshi have I just didn't expect someone uh, a clan that literally had one castle and one village to have 29 lords like what are the chances of that <laughs> alright is that it? that's it 
Uh, Kitabantake, you are my prisoner now out there. We're just taking them prisoner one by one by one. Uh, veteran auto spearman? Nope, no body bearer. That's what you gotta be. I have no idea why you're here. Release him. Didn't even notice that we had a Kenai rebel in there. Ugh. Hate him. Alright. Access the items, anything. Nope. Leave everything else. So that was an additional lord. I believe that was two lords, actually. Okay, so everybody here. Accompanying me. Yep, still accompanying me. Everybody's still accompanying us. Good, 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 good. But the thing is, if I try and join... Like, see, this is the... This is the uh, annoying thing. Even though I have what is essentially a larger force than they do. Pretty sure. Like, almost every each and single one of these lords has like 300 units with them. Plus Akahoshi's units, you know. Uh, despite the fact that we are all here, if I try to jump into that battle, it's just gonna be me and Akahoshi versus everything else. Versus everybody else. Um, running from Great Lord Otogawa by running into me. Interesting. Uh, battle on our side, battle on our side. Alright. It's good. Say this only once, and we will attack without even looking. There. Ah, he managed to escape. Alright. Uh, I will be taking the gunners. Thank you. And that is it. We basically have no other choice but to wait for Akahoshi to do his thing. Because, yeah, see. Like, if, I, if I rush to the aid, I'll be alone. So, I simply have to let Lord Akahoshi... Or, I count on that happening. Everybody else jumping in, in which case we will also jump in. But, we will jump in in the next episode, everyone. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining me. I have been Kaiser. This has been a beginning to an interesting war. Even though, you know, I did not expect to take Sumota Castle so easily. But, I am already biting my words, considering the fa this fact. Like, most of our enemies so far have never gathered a force that large. And keep in mind that this is just, what is that, like, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10... That's only 12 of their lords. They have 29. <laughs> so, yeah, there's gonna be a lot of fighting, and I'm gonna love it. At any rate, guys, I will see you next time, and until then, as always... Ad Gloriam. <laughs>